first things first, I want to tell you that you should only withdraw your VUL, number one, if you've reached the goals you originally set. Tandaan, you bought a VUL for a certain goal. Maybe you would want to raise or, or save up money and invest for the education of your kids, for your retirement, for a big goal in the future. Na achieve mo na bayon. That's the first reason why, and probably the, the, the most important reason why you should withdraw your VUL. The second reason, if it's beyond 10 years, um, if it's beyond 10 years, I'm sure all VULs don't have withdrawal charges anymore. So if it's beyond 10 years and then na-reach mo na yung goal mo, di, man, di mas maganda, um, it's I think the perfect time that you would withdraw yung VUL. The third reason uh, would probably be that you understand that there are withdrawal charges. If you are withdrawing, less than 10 years pa lang, especially if less than 5 years pa lang, definitely there will be withdrawal charges. Meaning, um, aside from the policy charges na nabawa sa'yo, kunyari nakahulog ka ng 100,000, ang pera mo sa account value mo, 70,000 pa lang, pag withdraw mo yung 70,000, may charge pa yun. No? So, if you don't understand that fully, then maybe you're, you, you know, you're making a decision na kulang yung information. So, you should with you should be able to withdraw your, your VUL if you understand that there are withdrawal charges possibly and okay ka doon, accepted ka doon. Your, your mind is at, is at peace with that. Then, okay. You can withdraw your VUL. Um, basta naiintindihan mo yan. And the fourth thing, probably the most important, is that you have other insurance policies. You have other life insurance policies that are in force. Why? Because there's a lot of VUL that we got, but we understand that there is also life insurance uh, coverage. Some may have critical illness coverage. So, insured ka as the policy owner. Pag you withdraw your VUL mo in full, you render it in full, all those benefits will be, you know, will be removed. Wala na siya. It will all be cancelled. So you are now be uninsured. Wala ka ng life insurance benefit in case of death for your family to continue their lifestyle. Wala ka ng critical illness coverage or hospitalization benefit. Just in case you get sick, saan ka kukuha ng pera. So if you don't have other insurance policies, maybe it's the wrong information. You're getting the wrong information. You're redrawing for the wrong reason. Diba? So if you have other insurance policies and then kinuha mo tong VUL na to because it's really for accumulation, then maybe go ahead. Right? Do it. 